Hello. My wife is a bit angry. <laughs> Hi guys. I'm not angry at all, you know that. This is a hundred take. Hello. Hi. Um so welcome back. You didn't delete the uh... No I didn't. But we should start over again. Just start over. Oh cool. Yeah. Hello everyone. Hi guys, how are you? We are super super grateful of the response on our last video, which was in total not that much, just us spending our time with you guys, getting to know each other. And the main thing we got out of the response of last video is you you want to know who we actually are, how we met, and where we are living at the moment. So I will introduce myself again. I'm Tessa, and this is my husband, Tommy. And we are living in Bandung, Indonesia. Yeah, and then um, kita juga ketemu di Bandung delapan uh, tahun yang lalu. Waktu itu istri saya lagi uh, study double degree. Uh, tahun pertamanya di ITB ya? Iya, yeah. um, ambil S2 di ITB sama juga di Belanda Tapi tahun pertama di ITB Iya, yeah, and then uh, abis itu balik ke Belanda Terus kita ketemu waktu uh, tes mau balik ke Belanda Because it was like a middle of, yeah, I think the middle of 2012, right? Yeah. Tengah, tengah 2012, yeah. and then you went back to the Netherlands later that year and then you datang lagi ke Bandung <laughs> no it's like I'm the a true st bad storyteller the true story true is tell. back in 2012 we met he tricked me into our first date because I was totally convinced other people would join as well but not at all um, so you got stuck in the car together with me only <laughs> kind of but the thing is I totally fell in love with him. I was completely even ready to marry this guy. But then I had to move back to the Netherlands because of my second master's degree. And uh, during that year in the Netherlands, I also went to an exchange with the University of Florida, so in the USA. Um, and then we, we broke kind up. of broke up. It's not kind of, we broke up. Uh, we broke up for real. Because, well, actually, have you ever been into that first butterfly stage of a relationship and then have a 12 hour time difference? It's crazy. It's not doable. The moment you wake up, the other person. Sleep or getting drunk and sleep. Yeah. <laughs> Or the moment that you're like in your most focused part of the day and then the other person is calling like, I miss you so much, I can't handle all this. And at some point I was like, Hon, I love you a lot, but I really can't handle this anymore. So yeah, we broke up in 2013, which is also like, it's a bad luck year, right? 2013, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, tapi kamu tiap tahun datang ke Indonesia. Yeah. Uh, holiday ya. Yeah. yeah. And uh, you had new relationships. I had new relationships. And in 2017 we met again. Yeah, I tried to met you. I tried to. I went to the Netherlands in 2015. To you with some. You were with somebody else. I was with somebody else. And. Uh, we met again in 2017? Yeah, and in 2017, for me, it was immediately, like, logical, like, oh, gee, I still really like this guy. So... Lucky me. Yeah, lucky you, definitely. <laughs> um, but what happened, like, I was visiting him in Jogja, where he was setting up his first business. First official business. And... Um, I 
he picked me up from the airport really nice i was sitting in his car and i think after half an hour or so i was already like so uh, because we don't have a lot of time yes so i was like uh so you don't have a lot of time i have my whole life there <laughs> no but i mean like i was just on a holiday i had to go back to the netherlands for work so so yeah i asked him like so uh, are we going to have an official date tonight <laughs> Ouch. so we had we had an official date about a year later we uh, got engaged and another year later so in 2018 we had our first marriage in the netherlands and then in 2019 about a year ago we had our second marriage in indonesia um and we want to tell you all about that but later um i think what's important to know now is that we how we met live in bandung yeah Currently, uh, we are really often also going to Jogjakarta uh, because, well, part of Tom's family is living there and he also has some businesses there. And um, I really, really love the Jogjakarta vibes. Um, lebih apa ya? Lebih tenang, lebih aman di Jogja ya. Lebih more. Leafable, more and of course the most important part the food. local food in Jogjakarta is still so much cheaper than in Bandung um, and really really good like I know all of you who've been traveling to Jogjakarta know that already but in the meantime we live in Bandung we absolutely love it here we love the cold and the fact we have our family clothes and yeah, the, um, the weather is really nice here in Bandung but uh... Just um, yeah, friends, family, <laughs> everything is close here in Bandung. Uh, that's why we love to stay here and have really fun memories of well, Tom already since he's little. Me from my what age did I move here? Like twenty second, twenty something. twenty something. <laughs> Your early twenties. Um. So yeah, that's why we live in Indonesia. Um, I already live here for one and a half years now. Lalu tautannya aku tinggal di Indonesia dua setengah tahun. Tidak bisa bahasa. Bisa bahasa sedikit. Enggak. Bisa bicara bahasa banyak, tapi belum lancar. Kalau aku ngomong-ngomong sama teman atau orang lain, aku suka bicara bahasa Inggris. And most important thing, when I'm angry, I'm talking in Dutch. <laughs> but that doesn't happen that often, does it? Yeah, but <clears throat> no, not anymore. <laughs> Just like once a day. <laughs> Which is not that often. Um, I really, really learned to be more sabar and more yeah, chill in total. Um, I don't know if this is the full full story you wanted to know if you have any more questions just let us know down in the comments below for now i really want to thank you for watching our video tom is also really enjoying the fact that you watch our videos uh, although maybe his face won't always show it you can always like or dislike it's fine anyways um yeah, what I said, really grateful, really happy to be sharing with you guys because I know so many people are wondering about us. Um, so we will slowly give you snippets of information about our lives. Okay, talk to you later. Bye. Doei. <laughs>